Let's take a moment to talk about John Cena. How does she come out on top in this fatal four-way? Obviously a talented competitor, Michael. But in a match like this, sometimes it comes down to luck. Not all the time, of course, but sometimes. Strikes like that can end this one in a hurry. What intensity! Well, that's the first time we've seen that move tonight from either locker room. I gotta love it. He's certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. Let's take a moment to discuss Shinsuke Nakamura. He comes into this fatal four-way with high expectations. What does he need to do to emerge victorious? I see somebody who's determined to walk away victorious. Unfortunately, I also see three others who are equally as driven to succeed. Something's going to have to give. Well, he has his hands full, that's for sure. The ring may not be big enough for what's about to unfold here. Are you kidding me? This entire arena may not be big enough. He's starting to feel it here. The fatal four-way environment might just be too much for him to handle. Well, Michael, he certainly thinks he'll have better success outside the ring than in it. We'll see if that holds true. Well, it's hard to argue that, but I'd say this one could go either way. Here's Shinsuke Nakamura. Making it to the top of the ladder may be the easy part. Once you start working on bringing that thing down, you are completely vulnerable. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. I can tell you this about where an opponent's head should be when he's in the ring with John Cena. If the opportunity comes up, you have got to put him away. Don't be caught off guard for one second. You're not going to get many chances to finish Cena off. And if you don't take the ones you get, you're going to regret it. He anticipated that move perfectly. Incoming! The top of that ladder looks awfully far away. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. Get him back into the ring now. You know, King, you make a good point, so I'll ask you this about that famous durability and resilience of John Cena. What is it that allows him to stay in matches even when it looks like he's on the verge of being dominated? I mean, we've seen him come back practically from the dead so many times. Oh, you're right. John Cena is just the ultimate competitor, Michael. He refuses to give in to anyone, no matter what state he's in. And Cena's only gotten tougher over the course of his career. That's what makes it even more astounding. He's as strong now as he's ever been. Boy, he was able to reverse it. Get out of that. Oh, and did you hear the impact? A knockdown, drag out brawl, complete with a big stomp. Man, these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. Here we go. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. He, okay, just swinging on his opponent. Well, we've got a man in the squared circle today. I'm talking about John Cena. That has to be regarded as having as brutal a finishing move as exists in WWE. Michael, you've got to be talking about the attitude adjustment. Yeah, the AA. If Cena can get you up onto his shoulders, you're going to be hitting the canvas hard, and I do not think you'll be getting back up. This guy's just getting worn out. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Finn Balor. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. Shinsuke Nakamura. He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? Good grief. Tremendous impact with that ladder. 
the more punishment he takes, the slower and slower he is getting back to his feet. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. That must have caused major damage. You just can't train to be ready for an assault like that. Wow! He's still down after that. King incoming! Ah! Onto the floor! I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Hitting up. Ooh, John Cena may have it. These competitors need to have their heads on a swivel if they want to survive this fatal four-way match. Good Finn Balor here. What's he thinking, Cole? I can tell you exactly what he's thinking. The shotgun drop kick. That's a number on your back. What a finishing maneuver. This could be it. It's got to be it. How much more? How much more are you willing to pay to win this match? This is unreal. see it one more time. Oh gosh, right down on the kidneys. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. This could be huge. Cena looking for something big. Looks like this one's going out to the floor. What was your first clue? I think I just heard something snap. This may be turning into a brawl, King. Yeah, just don't bring it over here. This match has taken so much out of this guy. He's not going to give up. But man, this has been physical. Back in the ring now. Whoa. You felt that go right through the body. You may not agree with this form of attack, but it's very smart. Now, time will tell if that'll be enough to win the match. He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. What a shot. What a shot from the ladder. Direct hit. I don't know if you can get back on your feet after that. Getting tagged like that might be enough to keep an opponent down for good. you think of that? What a match. What a fight. When you reach this point, all bets are off. Anything can happen, and I love it. This one's getting ugly. You might want to turn away if you have a weak heart. Oh, his body has to be broken right now. That may be the first time we've seen that executed. Ladder and flesh both appear in worse condition. Oh, oh, what a shot! Now, once again, we see a return to this specific maneuver. Hey, but it works. Yeah, if it keeps working, keep working. He's showing no signs of letting up. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. The ring may not be big enough for what's about to unfold here. Are you kidding me? This entire arena may not be big enough. Now back to the ring. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. He wants no part of the outside. Then I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Tossed out like a rag doll. He dropped like a stone king. How many cliches can you and I use? He dropped him like a big... Oh, my. Get the medics down here. The top of that ladder looks awfully far away.
There you have it, your fatal four-way winner. like anybody's match there toward the end. That's what I like to call a statement win, Michael. I'd like to think we just saw one of the greatest title matches in a very long time. I hope you enjoyed it, folks.